when I say Ghana is better than Nigeria, a lot of people will come under my comment section and be saying nonsense. Hello, welcome to my channel once again, once again. See, many a times we talk about Ghana and Nigeria in so many ways. We compare ourselves with our food, with everything that both countries have. But there has been a lot of Nigerians who are currently living in Ghana. And some too have schooled here, gone back and forth and all that. Some even go back and they just decide that, no, let me move back. To Ghana so sometimes when I hear Nigerians talk about Ghana I'm not so surprised because if you are in Nigeria and you've lived in Nigeria all your life then when you see Ghanaians and Nigerians going at each other on social media and if you are Nigerian then when you see people talking about Ghana you might think they are over exaggerating because you have not been in this country before but I'm telling you if you visit Ghana you will understand what all these people are talking about here in this video i have two nigerians who took to social media to express their love for ghana and also let you know why ghana is better than nigeria let's go into the video when i say ghana is better than nigeria a lot of people will come under my comment section and be saying nonsense you'll be saying nonsense have you seen the current exchange rates the current exchange rate now is 7.6 have you 7.7 .7. last week it was 8 point something you that you, know, you are not living in Ghana, you are in Nigeria talking nonsense. You don't know what your, your government is doing. Instead, they won't regulate social media. When they don't pack their children, go abroad. Don't loot plenty money, go abroad. You dare, you dare under my comment section and make up your own problem. You dare Nigeria, you don't know how much exchange rate be for Ghana be. You don't know how, if 100,000 for Ghana like this, be like 10,000 naira for Nigeria. 100k for Ghana, it be like 10,000 naira for Nigeria. Person if you carry 100,000 naira, do anything better for Ghana. What do you want to do? The government don't spoil the money to the extent you'll be saying even naira no get value for anywhere again. When I stand on top of stupid mandates, mandates will be saying when papa no you use buy anything for Nigeria. Mandates will be saying a hunger. Now they, now they, now they, use, now, now they use bath. And they talk say Ghana better pass Nigeria. They come under my comment section. They talk nonsense. You don't travel before. You don't travel before. You say, come on, Ghana. Come on, Ghana. If you feel survivor, 100,000 for Ghana like this. 100,000, what we say, they, they give you for Nigeria, where you they tank person. They know if you give you 100,000 for, for Ghana, you say you go tank person. They know if you give you, you know if you carry 100,000 for Ghana, you know if you survive with 100,000 for one week for Ghana. One week, 100,000, no if you do for one week for Ghana. And they talk, and they, and they tell me, say, and they make Ghanaians they insult Nigeria. You know this to insult. When our own politicians, where they loot the money, they carry their children, go stay abroad. How many times do I don't go fight them? How many times do I don't protest? Hunger day everywhere for Nigeria. No nobody they talk. Now me where they on my own. They try let me know see the government. They do bad. Now me now won't call the attack. It makes sense. It makes sense. Today now, SNG na 7.6. Tomorrow now if you go five. Here's why Ghana is doing better than Nigeria as at today. Their GPS location is working. Because the government have invested a lot in the country. That means anybody can be found. Unlike in Nigeria. Before, if you do something for Abuja, travel, go to Port nobody will know what you did. So you can skip justice. Ghana has traffic light cameras at every traffic light and every traffic junction. So you cannot beat traffic. Nigeria wants to give weapons to road safety. Road safety, we say they don't even get good reputation already. Now, one can't give them this thing. Now, Nasabi, Ghana police has good accommodation, transport, and even boats. Imagine that a police service that has everything they need and what they don't even need, they have it. When Ghana gets everything, they get good car, they get staff bus, they get accommodation, they need to pay water bill, they need to pay light bill. Nigeria, now, if you see their police barrack, it's like cell. That's why when they put you in cell, they don't even feel guilty. Because where did they live, self? most of them was passed when they threw you in. I mean, they are rich police officers. I'm talking about the majority, don't forget. They don't even have staff bus. If they before before that I remember they will, they will run and enter bus, they will not want to pay the bus driver. They will say they are police, they are staff. Until Nigerian bus drivers started disciplining them and disrespecting them and disgracing them because you, this police that I helped this morning to go and drop you at work. When you are at work, it's the same you that will see me and try to extort me. So the bus drivers said no. Ghana police vehicles always look new. Nigerian police vehicles always look like something they come up for scrapyard or something will escape accident. You can hardly see a drunk Ghana police. But in Nigeria, 
we see them every day you go even find some nigerian police personnel self they stay for front of their police station they smoke cigar go and ask them they will tell you ghana has price regulation problem but it is the citizen that is the problem why nigeria has no regulations at all period survive at your own risk ghana if something if this bottle water now now two cd for my shop for the next shop where they beside my shop they will sell at five cities and no concern anybody ghana don't they try to correct the issue this and that this and that but the Ghanaians that them they, they are safe they, they put money on things by themselves and that's bad you're killing your own brothers by yourself but nigeria no regulation at all you go see us with the, the, the beat traffic here 247 that's the least regulation I can even put. BRC, where they bring, where would they happy about? Now, BRC, they're very small, they go to shit inside. Talking about price regulation, price regulation is not even in this country, too. But in Ghana, they used to do jungle justice for anybody that tried to, when they catch you, or when you try to do it too much in Ghana, they will discipline you. But in Nigeria, they'll say, hey, Naim, oh, make you put in price. So with these few points I've made, let me know what you think in the comment section. If you think these points are correct or not, let's get it. Yes. Why they do this video this night and by this time? Now for two reasons. Sure you understand. One, I'll make you see lights. You understand? Lights for this place. Two, I'll make you see the safety of this place for night. Now let me day where they do the video. You see him? Yeah, I did my outside. See my gate. Sure you get. You get one video where they fly for internet where senior man Sabalo. Where they go generator side Lista. You go they tell people say eh, see oh Ghana where they talk say see generator for Ghana. That one no be gen, no be ordinary gen. That one a Lista. Now, big, big men, where did they, they use Lister? And for years, before you see, say somebody use them, it be company, banks, where them just, they use them as alternatives in case of anything of his up. Sure, you understand? But waiting at the expert, Mr. Balo go show us, now that small gen, that way they make noise. That's Yamaha and that Tiger generator. That way we say, they make noise. That way we say that they mix them with engine oil and fuel. Now that one, now we we'll make it go show us for Ghana. Make it now that one now go take short top while go come down. Make it show us we too will be Nigerian, so we did for Ghana here. Show you understand. We be Nigeria where we did Ghana here. Uh -huh. So I want to make Sabalo go show us that small gen that passed my neighbor. Make it still show us the one way uh, 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 that other one way pass that passed my neighbor small. This one where they show us now company use something now. The one where company go fi use bank go fi use for Nigeria save now lucky all those big 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 men company call rooms with them they use that one. But when they talk about the normal somebody, normal normal life, normal normal life. Sure you understand the lister, the that the generator, that small generator where they use. Make it sure like you know, go feel bring them out. This be most of the times Nigerians will say we have big economy, our artists are very popular. But the question is the big economy that you have, is the economy feeding you? Is it helping you in any way? These artists that are popular, when they play their shows and whatever, do they give you some of the money? See, when we are talking about a country being better, the basic things that as a citizen in a particular country or even when you're a foreigner and you travel into the country, you enjoy. One particular thing is peace and another one is safety. You see, these are some of the things and when it comes to water, light, these are the things that we talk about. I always say this on my channel that when you talk about infrastructure wise, comparing Nigeria to Ghana, Nigeria is very big, but still Ghana can never compete with Nigeria when it comes to infrastructure, especially the buildings, not roads, you see. But man, that is not what we are talking about. Because if I'm in a country, they have the skyscrapers, they have whatever, the economy is big and whatever, and I'm not benefiting or it is not benefiting me, then what am I doing in that country? You understand? So when people come on social media and they talk about Ghana being better than Nigeria, they are not trying to say that, hey, you have the skyscrapers, the basic amenities 
the basic things that a citizen should enjoy light water security freedom to move about these are the things that people experience in ghana so when they come on social media and they're talking about it you might think they are over exaggerating until you visit ghana for me all i will say is hey if you're a nigerian and you want to visit ghana feel free come but I'm assuring you that the feeling that you will have visiting Ghana will never be the same when you go back to Nigeria. Thank you so much for watching.